This message is transmitted at the request of the United States government and the United Nations. From this day forward, internet access will be shut down and outlawed worldwide. Anyone caught accessing the internet will be prosecuted to the highest extent of the law. An ongoing legal stalemate over the future regulation of the internet has drawn protesters to several U.S. cities. The internet is something that we've come to depend on every day, the same way we depend on water or electricity. We are on the right side of history, the fight to save the internet as we know it. After the riots, the world took a big shift. No more Google. No more social media. No more internet. The world had to revert back to the ways it was before the internet existed. When the government outlawed the net, they thought they were doing the people a favor. But what they didn't realize is all these years, we had access to this digital drug. So by the time they took it away, we was already addicted. They created an underground market. Some people call it a crisis. <laughs> I call it an opportunity. Wherever there's a demand, there's money to be made. And I'm a motherfucking hustler. Hacker by trade. Hello? Lotto, we just got a shipment. Will the package is touched down? It should be at your crib right now. Okay. They say it came from some nigga named Darkseid. Out of Miami. Alright, I'm gonna get my boys together, man. Make sure you let your boys know that they can't fuck this up. We gotta stay under the radar. This gonna change the game right here. Oh, this the game changer? Okay. My pack just came in today, too. So what I'm going to do is give it to my youngins on the east side, let them move it. And I know you got the SWATs and the south side locked down. If we do this right, and we'll control the market, my nigga. <laughs> if it's the game changer, I'm guaranteed to go. All right? Let's get this money. Credits at 
say no more. Andre ain't gonna believe this shit. Know what this is? Man, bro, that look like a thumb drive to me. This is the future. It's gonna make us rich. How was that? I don't know if you noticed. The product we used to sell ain't selling no more. Crack gone, cocaine and pills. People lying on the internet. How we supposed to sell the net? and distribute it without the government tracking us down. I got the direct connect. Untraceable. Who is it? Motherfucker, you asked too many questions. Are you in or you out? How's we gonna sell the net? Don't you know that's a mandatory life sentence? Bro, I can't go back to prison, bro. And you won't, nigga. Imagine. No trafficking. No bagging the product. No putting no product on the scale. No stepped on product. All we need is laptop. And thumb drive. And we don't want to have it. We'll run this fucking city. Y'all with me? Shh, I'm here. Different product, same hustle. Fuck it, let's get it. Now that's the injury I know. Let's eat. What you got for me? 48 hours, internet, secure, untraceable line. Just what I needed. Nah, you look like what I need. Look, we gonna do business or what? I ain't got all day. Calm down. I got the drive. You got the money? I ain't come all the way out here with no money. Stop playing. No money, no product. Here. Now remember, you get caught, you don't know me. All right, bet. We have her under surveillance and we'll be watching her for the next 24 hours. Uh, I'll be meeting with them tomorrow evening, and I will keep you updated. You will know as soon as I know. Correct, sir. Of course. Bradshaw, we have a problem. Something needs my immediate attention. I'll call you back. What is it, Veronica? Another civilian has accessed our encrypted internet network. That's impossible. No one can access the internet but government officials with high security clearance. Not quite. It appears that this person has found a way to access our satellites by independently bypassing our encryption. Where? The numbers seem to be concentrated in one area. That's Atlanta, Georgia. This is not good. That means it's spreading. This needs to be dealt with immediately. This is not your typical hack. This is going to take some time. No! You don't understand. The most valuable asset in the world right now is data. It's worth even more than oil. Internet corporations were getting too big, and sensitive data was being sold to foreign countries and used against us. So much so that they rigged our elections, manipulated our citizens, and spread propaganda. The 
internet has ruined the moral fiber of our country, and this is the reason why we shut it down. Internet addiction is what caused the great riots of 2025. And if civilians get access to the internet again, we will be on the verge of another civil war. So what do you suggest we do? The situation needs to be eradicated and the players exterminated. Exigent circumstance. Correct. But I'll handle it expeditiously. But use an independent contractor. I want this to happen under the radar. I know just who to call. Veronica, the information you just shared with me does not go beyond us. Are we clear? We're clear. Good. Get it done. I'm on it. Dark side. Fresh all what's up? Change of plans. Hello? Bruh, listen man, he just shot your brother, dog. What? He dead, nigga. Who? Your motherfucking brother, dog. When? What the fuck you wanna do? We gotta put in some work. All right, bitch. Hello, Bradshaw? Yes, Veronica? I have good news, and I have bad news. Give me the good news first. Well, the good news, one of the players is taken care of. And the bad news? The other one got away. Veronica, you told me you were going to handle this. You gave me your word. I'm catching a flight to Atlanta immediately, and you can brief me when I get there. All right, talk to you soon. Bye. Everything's in motion. 
I'll let you know when the job is complete. Huh. They ain't gonna know what hit them. Good afternoon, Bradshaw. Welcome to Atlanta. So glad you could make it. I would like to ask, who is this that you brought with you today? This is my assistant, Beth. Well, hello, Beth. Nice I to meet you. I didn't know we were involving other parties. You're not the one who makes that decision now, are you? You're absolutely right. I just asked you to come by here so that I could brief you on what transpired with the suspects in question. You mean your screw-up? Well, it wasn't exactly a screw-up. I mean, I did eliminate one of the suspects. <laughs> Calm down. I've got this. You think because you're a politician, you can't be touched? I see you used your illegal internet to find me. That's another reason we had to take it away. Too much access. Mm -hmm. You killed my brother. Then you tried to kill me. Obviously, you don't know who the fuck you fucking with. Back the fuck up. If you were gonna shoot somebody, you would have done it by now. You know what your problem is. You didn't use the internet. You let the internet use you. You fell right into my trap. No, motherfucker. I am the trap. It's called supply and demand. You can't keep it from us forever. We'll burn this bitch down. By we... You mean your partner, Darkseid, right? Who do you think gave you up? He works for me. What? Nothing personal. Just business. All nuts, no glory. <laughs> what, what do we do? Where do we go? <laughs> I think we should leave. Oh my god! Bradshaw! I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What it's nothing personal. Do? It's just business. <laughs> Life is like a game of chess. You use your pawns and your queens to take out the king. Now I'm the only one that has the world in the palm of my hand. The future belongs to me.